Government and utility representatives from Brazil recently visited the United States on a U.S. Trade and Development Agency reverse trade mission focused on showcasing telecommunications technology for power distribution. The Brazilian delegates learned about the latest U.S. equipment, services, and best practices while meeting with U.S. companies and utilities in Washington, D.C., Manassas, Virginia, and Atlanta, Georgia. Also included in the reverse trade mission were policy and regulatory meetings with U.S. government agencies. Through these meetings, the Brazilian delegates were able to explore innovative approaches to managing smart grid and power distribution. As a regulator, I'm really concerned about the regulatory issues that's going on and getting uh, in touch with new technologies that have been deployed in the U.S. It's very um, enlightening for us so we can go back to Brazil and try to improve our regulation to meet the demands that the industries have for deploying new techn technologies back there. It's been very nice for that. I'm learning a lot. USTDA organizes these reverse trade missions to provide access for U.S. companies to foreign buyers. So we think that this reverse trade mission was a really great example of that. We hope that this reverse trade mission really benefited the Brazilian power industry officials because they were able to see U.S. technologies in action on site at Georgia Power, at the city of Manassas, and other places, and meet U.S. providers of these technologies because they really want to invest in the best for their systems. And so having these types of experiences and these conversations we think was really useful for them. The delegation had an opportunity to attend a Brazilian marketplace workshop in Atlanta, Georgia, where U.S. companies received briefings on upcoming business and export opportunities in the telecommunications sector. The workshop was held in conjunction with the 2015 UTC Telecom and Technology Conference. As Brazil works to innovate its telecommunications technology to meet the energy needs of its rapidly growing population, USTDA will continue to support the country's infrastructure projects while promoting U.S. exports. You know, it's an opportunity where we can have together different companies, different customers in the same room, where we can not only learn from them what are their, their most important challenges, and also how we can help them in the end of the day. Now, when we come back to Brazil, we know much better how we can impact their, their uh, bottom line, or at least uh, provide better services to them through the use of our solutions. Right? I just would like to say thanks for the opportunity. It's been great. And I think you guys keep doing that because in Brazil we like uh, to get in touch with these new technologies and new, new, new ways of thinking about the industry. And it's been very nice. Thank you very much, USDA. I'm Steve Lewis reporting, U.S. Trade and Development Agency Public Affairs.